here in Germany's capital city of Berlin at the annual European Congress of Rheumatology, a study was presented that looked for predictors of remission response among children treated with etanercept for juvenile idiopathic arthritis. And Dr. Ravelli, can you tell me what the predictors are that you found? Yes, let me first say that uh, among uh, our series of children with JA who were treated with etanercept, we found that uh, uh, the response rate, the remission rate, was uh, around 50%, which means that uh, around, uh, about half of our patients with uh, uh, this disease who were given a tanercept were able to uh, reach a state of uh, complete remission that is uh, uh, defined as, as, the, no, as, as the complete uh, absence of any sign of symptoms of active disease. Okay. And uh, among uh, this series, we found that uh, the uh, absence of involvement of the wrist joint and the younger age at this presentation predicted, predicted the achievement of uh, uh, inactive disease during therapy of, with etanercept. Okay, so when a, a physician has a young patient with JIA in their office and they have no wrist involvement and they're a younger age, which, what does that mean in terms of treatment? This means that children with, with uh, uh, these characteristics are more likely to uh, achieve inactive disease during treatment with etanercept. But, but this means that, on the other hand, that children w uh, who have involvement of the wrist joint and uh, who are older at disease presentation are less likely to experience inactive disease during etanercept therapy. So this patient subset uh, is, uh, um, should be regarded as, more, um, as less likely to uh, experience a, a good outcome with therapy, and therefore these children might deserve earlier introduction of a transept or uh, association of a transept methotrexate with methotrexate since the beginning of therapy, because it is known, it has been shown, that a transept, when uh, administered in, uh, concomitantly with methotrexate, might work better than when uh, given alone. Okay, so instead of monotherapy, you start yes, with the combination. Yes, a combination therapy, etanercept plus methotrexate. This has been Damien McNamara reporting from Berlin.